Hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück bei The Wolf Among Us. Ja, wir sind jetzt in dem Hotel und wir müssen im Zimmer 207. Und ja, ich würde sagen, wir gehen da doch einfach direkt mal rein und schauen uns da um. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Bigby. I can't just let you go into any room you want. Seriously, what if someone found out? I could get into a lot of trouble. You have to let me in there. This is the room, 207. But I... This is the room Lily was in. Ugh, <sighs> fine. Well, that's weird. This key is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty! Ah, shit. Beast? Big B? How could you do this to me? No, sweetie, no. Wait a minute. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love- It's not what you think. Please. You're cheating on me? With him? No, no, Beast. I promise I'm not. I'm helping him. That's all. I'll bet! I'm sure you help each other just great! This is a murder investigation. She's helping me- Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, listen to me! There's nothing going on! I'm not- uh, Hey! Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! Is this you staying out of it? I thought I could trust you! Listen to your wife. Just calm down and- Beast! What the hell do you think you're doing? You aren't even listening to me! She's my wife, Bigby! I told you! this? Bigby. Look what you did to the door! You can't just act like this whenever Stand you- Stand back! You- you don't want to see this. Beauty, stay in the hall. What? Why? What's going on? Oh! <gasps> oh my god! Don't touch anything. Is this- is this- Lily met her client here. Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then- must have happened right here. Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty, what? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work the front desk. I... so that's... Do you remember who rented this room last night? I don't think anyone did. Not last night. Maybe they have it long term. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? It just seemed like a totally normal night. How is that even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. I'll explain later, okay?
Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. I can't believe this. Do all the rooms have these same clocks with the built-in cassette player? I think so, yes. Where'd you get that? Lily had it in her hand. In case there was any doubt over who died here. Do you smell something? No. Just apple. We shouldn't even be in here. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story, anyway. The whole book is about her? Yeah. Hmm. What is it? I think the apple is part of his fantasy about Snow White. That would explain the one we found on the floor. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here because they were acting out the scene in the book. Of course. That makes perfect sense. They were acting out the thing with her stepmother and the apple. Which is really creepy when you think about it. You know she almost died when... Uh... Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Hmm. Oh no. What? What is it? I think he made up the bed to match the coffin in the picture. Flowers, too. He'd have had Lily lie down just like this. You mean just before? In the story, that's when someone comes to kiss her. That's our Mr. Smith. This is just bizarre. This guy really has a thing about snow. It's like pathological. I'm getting that feeling, yes. Oh my god, that poor girl. She couldn't have known. She probably just needed the money. She could have been anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person... We can't know the answer to that. Every situation is different. Yeah. She must have been so scared. He brought wine. Classy. Maybe she didn't see it coming. It's a huff and puff. I thought you were the only one who smoked that crap brand. Apparently not. Damn it. Get it together, beauty. Be strong. Bigby, this? I think I heard this music. Last night, it was playing pretty loudly for a while and then stopped in the middle. I didn't think twice about it at the time. I, I mean, you hear all kinds of things around here and I guess I've already gotten used to blocking them out. Could have covered up the sound of the murder. with this dress. It's torn. Oh no. She must have been wearing it. 
He killed her and then... and then he took it back off? No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? This is the same dress as the one in the book about snow. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it, to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. It's another match to what's in the book. God, I can see the whole picture now. It, it all goes together like you said. This creep put that girl in a Snow White dress and, and recreated the whole story from the book with the apple and, and the deep sleep and everything. You're a better detective than I thought you'd be. Thanks. So he planned it all out. He had all the details noted down. Only then, when it comes time to kiss her and wake her up... Yeah. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Bigby. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. His stand-in for Snow is gone now, so... The next step closer. What is it? It's... <gasps> Crane. He could be after you now. Good. I am dying to get my disgusting weasel. I'm really starting to like you, Sheriff. You're not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. Hello, Big B. Take care of it, Big B, or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? Ja, dann haben wir die zweite Episode auch schon fertig. Ja, Biest braucht man nicht schlagen. Der ist nicht böse. Und ja. Gut, dann würde ich sagen, Episode 3 schauen wir uns in der nächsten Folge an. Ich hoffe, ihr hattet Spaß und bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss.